I heard about 3D Chimera many years ago, I'd say around 2015. For my studio, I needed uh, somebody to, to 3D print in Miami. And at that time, it was not many companies. It was not yet the trend in the US. And uh, 3D Chimera is the first uh, company I tried. And I've been following with them for so seven years now. So the project is for a local artist. His name is Tony Vasquez. He's from Venezuela. He's having a solo show uh, during our Basel. And one of the projects uh, is to have his face scanned and printed. And then we're going to make a mold. And out of this, he's going to create like a decanter where the piece is going to melt and get received in, in the negative part in the bottom. It's a little intricate, but uh, once you see the final result, you will understand. So the first step was to how do we mold or get Tony's head very like faithful to the original in a not too expensive way and in a very detailed way. So we called Alex. So we look first in the options to how to mold a, a bust. So obviously it has been done before because people make masks and things like that. We looked at the process online and it takes about like five people and the person has to stand still for like five hours and they have to apply multiple layers of different products. So that was one option. But then I thought, why don't we 3D scan uh, uh, Tony and it's easier like that and we get a 3D print and off we go. We end up doing the, the 3D scanner with two different kind of scanners to get the, the best result. Uh, Alex was very professional on this and helped us get the best of both and had um, two files combined so we can get the, the right result and he avoided having Tony getting with straws in his nose for five hours and not being able to move while we are working on him. So we thought it was a much better solution. I'm very satisfied so far. Everything has come out the way we wanted. Uh, every time, you know, we never know how projects, you have an idea of things, how they're going to go. And then you see the final result. And sometimes we have to take some detours. But so far, we are very happy. Look at this beautiful piece.